We're back with another episode of Ranked, and this one is jam-packed with a lot of great moments. We ran into a full pro lobby, had some really intense back and forth matches, and we had one of the most tragic endings to a ranked game in a while. I hope you guys have been enjoying the daily uploads lately, and there's a lot more crazy videos coming up. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the SSL gameplay. All right, for the first game, we got Shad and Razebull, two players from Complexity. Shad's actually on his Epic Games account. Uh, let's see how it goes. Always very easy to play with Atomic. I'm trying to bump uh, Razebull off that ball, so Atomic has a free ball here while I get the back corner. He hit it a bit too hard, so I can keep that pretty close. Good play from Atomic. Good try on this double. Pass it back to Shad here. I have a little bit of space. Try to get a pop over the one. Thomas to be in a tough situation for a second. Chad's gonna beat him. Got a few boost pads. Oh, bump him? Oh, what a chip. What a follow, too. I sit back here, wait for the 50 50. I had to go early there because he was gonna go for a very heavy touch if I didn't go. Good block. I fake that. Wait for a topic's touch off the side. Maybe a double shot. Might be open. What a shot. Nice placement. <laughs> really good play off the side there. So I tried to get around the one player on the side wall, and there was already someone looming, but Atomic was ready for the catch. Really good touch. I gotta be a little careful here. Where I'm going with this. Fine. As long as I force him off the, the target, that's all that I really needed to do there. I'll go over the one. Razeball's going to be there on the backboard. I think he's pretty low, though. I'm trying to conserve my boost while I go down the wall. Hopefully get this mid boost, too. Okay, so a little bit early of a challenge again, but it should work out. Thanks. Atomic has some space. Also has 100 boost. Oh, big fakes. Good bump on the one. It's a round, but Atomic is getting the back corner first, so... I down with the other one. Oh. Sorry, tried to shoot that. Once I got the demo, I thought it was pretty open, but I didn't get the angle on it. I think a shad missed. Oh, musty into an air dribble. Good try on the bump. Keep it close. I'm trying to force something in the middle there, but it wasn't really the best plan. I'm gonna wait for Atomic. Maybe force him a little bit. That's over one. 50 50 as well. Grab a few boost pads in front. A 68 boost. Okay, threw it away. Force him to rush a little bit. It's two of them. What a double. Yeah, I probably shouldn't have chipped it like that because it gives Shad a free double tap opportunity. Unfortunately, Atoma couldn't get the touch on the back wall, which put him in a bad situation in the, in the beginning, so. Oh. So he's pretty low. I know that. That's fine if he bumps because Atomic gets the ball for free instead. 50 50 on both. Decent. Raise balls up already. Chad's going to go for a dribble here. I have to try and stop him in some shape or form here. Okay. I'm going to try and stay with this in 50. It actually works if Atomic wants it because I have zero. fine. I knew he was going to beat me, so I just tried to back off. And if he got a 50-50, at least I would be there. Get 50-50. That's a fast shot. I don't think he can save it. And there we go. So yeah, I got a good 50-50 in midfield with the raise ball chasing down the ball. And then I was able to set up the fast shot. It wasn't perfect placement, but it was enough because he couldn't really get to it. That's perfect placement, though. <laughs> Thank you, thank you. I got a good 50-50, and I still have a lot of boost. I like to try to hold on a lot of boost after the kickoff, so at least if I get in the situations, I can go for a nice shot top left or something. And end up working out. Go back corner here and just bang this. Probably going to be cut off on the ceiling. Ah, Atomic has free space here. I can't go for a double here. I messed up my first touch. Good 
So stay with us here. Nice pinch over one. Razable has the clear. Oh, they didn't have good, good, good enough control though. Because I got that pinch over, I think it was uh, Shad in midfield there. Um, and it ended up working out really well because Razable had to get a really awkward catch off the side. He didn't want to clear out to the left because I was in a position where I could really follow it pretty easily. Oh, okay. No problem. GG's. Oh, I got one game in with him. <laughs> so let's let's keep going and see how we how we do. Right, so we got Tricky on our team. He's actually a really solid 2v2 player. I haven't really seen him in threes much. I don't know if he's on a team. And we got Crispin Yando. Yo and <laughs> I don't really know how to say that name. I got some space here. I'm gonna make a soft touch. Go 50-50 here. I'm not gonna go for that because Chris was in an awkward position. He's gonna already make a bad touch, so I'm gonna wait for Tricky to pop this over him. There we go. Let him go for it. Fake. And <laughs> we get a goal. Really good bump by Tricky, and the other guy panicked. He thought I was gonna shoot right away, so I was just trying to keep it close. Cause I am last man there because Tricky's in the net, so I don't really want to do anything crazy and bang it off the wall or like goal or something. Okay, first touch here. It's round one, but yeah, Yo and Do I'm gonna call him Yo. I don't really know what else to call him. Just sort of a musty flick. I'm gonna try and bump him here. So it gets a little bit of pressure relieved, but that also means that he's gonna be back, so it's kind of a double edged sword. Oh. Double here. Got bumped, but I can still stay with this. I didn't get the touch that I wanted, but it should be okay because Tricky's gonna be back. Really good first touch as well because it keeps it close off the wall. Good try as well. It was a very telegraph pass because of the way that my car's positioned. It's not really gonna do anything for us, but it forces the car out of net at least. There we go. Just gotta do a backflip there. If I did a front flip, I would have missed, so I had to make sure I really kept that close. Not the greatest touch from Crisp. He was panicking off that, that clear from my 50 50. Because of that, it ends up going really really fast into midfield and tricky was ready for it if people have pounced like so early nowadays it's um it's insane the, the the level of skill is so like high now that you cannot give anyone time so a lot of the things that like would work at a lower level might not work up at the highest level that's why like honestly you see a lot of like clips and stuff being happening at like lower lower ranks i feel like like clips of like crazy goals because like, yeah, those goals will, um, you know, get you a goal once in a while. Or those, uh, those like tricks you do. But a lot of the times, oh, a lot of the times just the basic, um, movements and the basic shots will get, secure you the highest level goals because like this really should be in, but <laughs> ends up being off the side, but we get like, we get a fourth on the second game. Unfortunately, we couldn't get Atomic for all of them because they got scrims. I feel like it's so hard to get people for, for ranked games nowadays because most people don't play ranked ends up just being uh you know a lot of players that are on the up and coming uh as you can see like most people are gc right now there's not very many ssls and i've hopped up and down between ssl a lot this season so far because there's really not many players so um at least at least at this rank i, I know that the player base is still pretty big but when you're up at the top there it's a very very small pool of players and i feel like it's very hard to uh to get uh consistent matches so i'm, I'm usually queuing for like three to four minutes at, at minimum uh but Sometimes we get lucky and get a pretty fast game. All right, for the third game, we got Toasty, Tricky versus me and Dribs. So I don't really play with Dribs too much, but I know he's a pretty decent player. Pretty fast shot. Good try on the save from Tricky. Pretty easy uh, start to the game there. Those cheats on the kickoff, when they pop over the player like that, it's really, really want to make sure you get those secure shots on goal. This is going to be really dangerous here because I got that boost stolen. Same with this one where... We're sitting with very low. Toasty left that boost for me. Over the one. Dribs has some space. He can he can take control here. I'll take this boost so I can go for the play. I messed up the double touch though. Or double pop. Not double touch. Good try from Dribs to try and touch that, I think. I don't know if he was trying to, but... It would have been really good. I would like to pop that forward to start making control on the field. We just gave them 100 boost for free two in the corner because of that. So I know that Tricky has 100. I know that Toasty's got a lot of boost too. He ends up missing the touch though. I'm going to pop this to the backboard and immediately leave because you can't really do anything with that when there's two people defending. And wow, what a challenge. <laughs> it even says wow right there. That's crazy. Confidence. 2v2 is very random. There is 
like at the highest level like i was talking about it's really just um it's all about speed it's over the one toast gonna get a save before we shoot this again kind of missed the mark still a difficult save for toasty though we like gave that boost to a uh, hundred boost to toasty again so he's gonna get the demo and then also push into mid here for the pass just fake him a little bit there and it should be open yeah i kind of got lucky there because i knew he was going to chase down the, the the ball but i didn't expect him to fully dive in like i saw him turn i just sat there waiting for him to go for the 50 50. So that was pretty good finish off the sidewall this could be dangerous here tricky's gonna have a touch maybe a miss he drips pops it forward he's gonna give it back to uh, toasty now because of that i have to wait for a shot let me go to the left side here a little bit with my touch I think Dribs is still looking for a boost or something. Try to pop that around. This should be okay. No, it's not okay. I was hoping that uh, that uh, Tricky hit that a little bit harder, but um, we got stuck in a pretty bad situation there. I probably shouldn't have challenged sat in net like I was. It's seeming to work most of the time this game when I ever just sat in the net. Let him pop it to the wall. It's a good bump from Toasty, but good challenge from uh, Dribs. Once again, I just know that he's going to go immediately. Everyone does that nowadays, so i going to let him. I don't really want to touch that again. I think it works better if Dribs has that right there, yeah. Oh, that was tough. I had to watch for the bump and the, the air dribble. So I was trying to do a little, little bit of a fake out and like go around the ball, but I really could have just probably jumped early and challenged, but always a chance that the 50-50 goes poor anyway, so. Decent shot. Makes it forces them off this boost so I can get them in as well, so it's pretty good. Maybe a double here. The good recovery from Tricky. And touch this. I think Dribs is getting beat. I'm gonna let Toasty touch this as well. Also four, both of them were pushing up really, really heavy. Good demo. And he was gonna go immediately again too, and I almost got it over him. Good cut from Dribs. Get this boost before he can in the corner. Good bump. I would have liked the demo there instead. I think he actually slowed it down a little bit. But this is backwards. Could be dangerous. Yeah. So if he got that demo instead of the the bomb, I'm not sure if he slowed down on purpose to bump him. But I would have preferred if he was dead. Um, and then Dribs, Dribs was fully backwards in net. He wasn't really. Uh, he could have done a 180 in net um, to like get himself more oriented towards the play. I think this is okay. Okay, he's not actually going. I probably shouldn't have went. I shouldn't have chased that down. That was silly. I'll leave this boost for Dribs if he wants. I got 40, probably at zero. Good try on the bump. I'm not sure who took this boost. It's fine if he throws it past. Although, this is a little awkward. Hit that too hard, unfortunately. He can go. This should work. I want Tricky to pop, pop this middle for me. Which he does. Strips a bit far, but that's a pretty good shot. Both both go for the save, so got some space now. Thought he was gonna go for that. No, nope. <laughs> My ball. Oh, I thought he was gonna challenge. Phil's been doing that a lot where he goes for an early, early play on the ball. Fine, he put it across the net. I'll wait here, see what happens. Good play. Around the one. Tricky kind of messed up his touch, so I get the corner boost for free. That should be dribs here. Good. I went low there and slow. Low and slow. Uh, because it's really um, in my advantage to let them panic. So I didn't really need to force anything. And if I hit that super hard, all it's going to do is just bounce back into mid if I miss. So I'd rather just play it slow. I think Toasty hit it to the wall so I can go for the, the clear cross. Once again, just playing it close. Should be dribs here. Could be open. Nice. There we go. Yeah, so that was really just, once again, patience. Letting them chase into the, into the ball because... If you, if you play the 50-50s right, you can force it in a position where it's going to be better for your team. 
you just gotta watch out for where uh, where your team is and then also um, where the opponents are. So really good third game. Uh, because of the quick forfeit in game two, we're gonna go to one more, uh, but we're looking pretty good. Let's uh, play again and move on. All right, for the last game, we have Toasty and Dribs, my teammate from last game with Shadow on my team. I didn't know Shadow still played. He used to be a pro, I believe, on the Charlotte Phoenix. I'm probably getting my boost taken here. I shouldn't have even chased in the corner. It's a little silly. But you get used to the fact knowing that like certain situations are just going to be uh, not in your favor. I have some space. If you get bumped, but that's okay. It's a good shot. Forces Dribs into an awkward situation. It was close. Got some space. Good bump. And there we go. So we got, got a really good position on the ball. Just chased it down and popped it around uh, Toasty and was able to get the boost as well. I'm not sure why Toasty went for the back corner boost because he's going to leave his teammate in a 1v1 for a really long time. It was actually a 1v2 because uh, Shadow was there trying to bump him and stuff. I'm going to let uh, Dribs hit this forward. Ooh. <laughs> um... I guess I should. I mean, I can't really do anything in there. There was nothing I could really do about Dribs touching that ball. He was gonna beat me if I go. So, take a 50-50. Dribs has a hundred boost though, so this is gonna be a little dangerous. I'm gonna go for a last second chip. Goes around the ball, around the goal. I mean, over a, a wide 50-50 here. Ended up landing on his car. A good try from Shadow. This could be dangerous. Good touch. I'll let Shadow go for this. You're really surprised that Toasty went. I'm going to be low here because uh, Shadow got that boost as well. So I expect that. Wow. He's going fast, man. <laughs> really about boost control. I didn't really want to take this, but okay, he wants to take it. That's fine. It looks like he still has boost. I still want to play that pretty careful, though, even though even though he was bumping him and stuff. Because like once again, if I go for a heavy shot and immediately. Uh, oh, gosh immediately go for it um then it could be a an easy dribble chance for them i don't think drips has an angle on this ball so we should be okay pop off the corner might be not the best touch from toasty but he does get a follow-up so it's definitely gonna get beat here it's fine i said to go a little bit close to make sure i get that that pop block yeah it's not a great touch from shadow we get we get put in a situation where they get a free shot i had to try and push up for it just a few weird turns where, like, it's not scary what he was doing there. So we could have just let him, you know, try to shoot that and block the angles. But because we're uh, challenging so so fast and so early, we're getting we're getting caught in really really awkward uh, positions on on defense. Oh my god, <laughs> that's crazy. Once again, he's like going to the walls. There's no risk. I don't think their last man's gonna go for this either. Ah, my bad. That was uh, definitely open. Try to grab a pad or two here if I can. I had to go behind him and then try to get the touch on the ball, but I couldn't quite get to it. Definitely probably should have just scored that. It was a, it was a very tough angle, but it was scorable. We can stay with this, maybe? Oh. Pop this up. Pop this up. It's fine if you want it. That's fine. We can we can just wait in mid here. It's a good dunk. Okay, a few a few really awkward um, <laughs> attempts at net here, and we're getting punished for it. Um, like that that touch really right here. I didn't think he would turn because he's definitely gonna get beat. Toasty's already facing the ball or dribs whoever that was. We're just getting really really uh, unlucky here. Few, a few situations where really we shouldn't be turning for a ball. It's a really interesting play from Dribs there. Yeah, I had to be really careful there. I knew that he was going to go for it again. Oh, no. A lot of awkward play in our net, but I'm just going to wait for this boost. I'm just going to wait. I got it. Should be all right. Maybe clear down. It's open. Unlucky. There we go. All right, we, we still got a chance here. We're vibing. 50 seconds. See if I can uh, hit this back right for him. He cheats, actually. 
Got the boost from him. We got a chance here. All right, we got a good chance, actually. <laughs> they messed up at net. I think they thought Shadow had that double, so that's, we're making it work. I'm going to try and cheat up here. Oh, I don't know why I did that. I gave Toasty a free clear. I think Shadow got that mid boost, though. It's across the Shadow. Can he get it? He almost did. Awkward touch from Dribs. Oh, man. i will let Shadow take this. Good try. Over one. Maybe off the corner. No, Shadow! <laughs> oh, no. It couldn't have ended any, any other way, honestly. If he touched that off the wall at all, that was a goal. He just completely missed the ball. What a funny way to end that. Like, I think, I, I think if he just cleared that, it would have been like obviously off the sidewall and then into midfield. I'm just going to check this before we end the video. I cannot believe that. All right. Cross gets a hundred boost. Hop over one. No, and I'm pretty sure he was getting beat here as well. Yeah, he was, and then I was. It would have just been off this wall right here, and then into midfield. Oh man, that is tragic. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Definitely a funny ending to uh, to a ranked session, but I uh, hope you guys are enjoying the daily videos. I'm right now trying to get ahead for uh, Dallas, so I've been recording a ton. <laughs> so this might be out quite a while after I actually recorded it. Um, but either way, I hope you guys enjoyed. Until next time, have a great day, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.